Hello, hello. All right, guys, it's Friday, and I uh, finally got some optic. All right, and this was, stuff was not easy to hunt down. I did not near get nearly, not even close to what I was hoping to find of this stuff today. Um, I haven't been hunting the Barrels and Orbals. That stuff is just too far for me locally to drive. Um, but anyway, it's story time, folks, okay? Check this out. This is what I found out today. There's some Walmarts in my area. I told you guys before, like, I can't drive no more than 15, 20 minutes in any direction without hitting a Walmart Supercenter. I just can't. There are so many in my area, which I've been blessed throughout this whole card saga drought. You know what I mean? That's how I've been able to find cards because I have tons of Walmart Supercenters. So, but there's a couple right now in my area that they're not stocking anymore. And a couple of them are high volume stores, where it's before they were getting a ton of stuff. So if you went there, if you had to split it amongst like, you know, five, six, seven people, you still got a lot of stuff because they were high volume. They they stocked a lot. Um, so it was good for everybody, right? But when Premier took over from Anderson, some of those stores haven't stocked since. All right. And I went to a Walmart today, and another guy I know he went to the Walmart and he's messaging me, this store hasn't stocked in so long. I'm at another store, I'm like, this store hasn't stocked in so long. Uh, you can look on the dates, okay, on the price, on the shelving. If you guys want to know when they restocked it last, look at the price, little yellow tags on the uh, shelves, okay? And below the price, it'll say a date. And that's the date they printed out the label, okay? And you can look on that and see what time they, when's the last date they shelved. The last time they some of these stores stocked was July 7th, July 8th, which is when Premier took over for Anderson, all right? So... I find store manager, he finds store manager, we're talking, um, blah, blah, blah. They don't know what's going on. There's an issue with the vendor. Um, there's no boxes in the back. They went and looked for it, blah, 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 blah. Why ain't there any boxes in the back if they didn't get restocked? What's going on, right? So I go back over to the store that he was at. And because it was later in the day, a few hours had passed. And I drove back over there and I found the manager that he talked to. I went to find a specific one. I messaged him. I was like, hey, what's this lady look like? He told me. I sought her out. I was like, hey, Mrs. So-and-so, you know, I'm here looking for the cards. You know, I'm a collector, blah, blah, blah. I was like, um, what's going on? They haven't restocked in a while. And this is a high volume store. We all got cards from here. And she's like, yeah, I don't know. She's like, it could be that Walmart is just discontinuing and we're going to eliminate this whole section because of the high theft rate. She's like, our theft is so high in this area. She's like, the, a lot of Walmarts just don't want to deal with it anymore. Because it's just too, people are opening packs right there at the, on the shelves, basically, you know? It's ridiculous. <laughs> but anyway, she's telling me that. And then she says, another guy came in here this morning. He's asking me the same thing. She's like, so I grabbed another lady and we went in the back and we looked for the MJ holding boxes. She's like, we couldn't find them anywhere. We don't know what's going on. Uh, she's like, they, obviously they haven't stocked. We can't find the boxes. She's like, so maybe they quit sending them. That's what she's saying. So I don't know what's going on, but I see the Anderson lady that used to stock it every week over there, right? So I go over to her. I was like, I, we sure miss you guys doing the restocking around here. And she's like, oh, what's going on? I was like, there's no stock. You know what I mean? I was like, it hasn't been stocked in weeks. I was like, what's, what's up with this? She's like, oh. She's like, I know what happened. I was like, what happened? Turns out she's the reason why that store, well, not the reason, but her actions led to that store doing what they did. And she went and she seen the premier vendor that was taken over for the carts in the back. She said it was a young kid, about 18, 19 years old. And he'd be sitting in the back in the break room all day on his phone, just messing around, sitting there. And she'd be like, hey, aren't you going to, you know, she seen like all these MJ Holdings boxes there. When she looked, she said she seen 20 MJ Holden boxes in the back. And they were cut open. And she said, but all the stuff was, a lot of the sports stuff was there. Prism. She says she knows the stuff we like. She's been doing it for years. She said, a lot of that stuff was there, though. She's like, so I don't know if they were taking it, but they weren't taking much of it. They did because all that football Prism stuff that you guys like, that basketball Prism stuff you guys like. She's like, oh, it was all there. I was like, oh, what? 20 boxes? She's like, yeah. Um, She's like, but she's like, he wasn't stocking it. She's like, he's just sitting there day after day in the break room. Wait, he said he's waiting out his shift because there's no balloons for him to do. She's like, aren't you going to do the MJ? He's like, I'm supposed to do balloons. There's no balloons. So she goes and she tells the Walmart manager. The Walmart manager says, tells her basically, um, he calls the DM for Premier. 
the district manager for Premier, right? Telling this guy this, blah, blah, blah. That guy's not doing it. I don't know. That young kid, he no longer was working at the store. I guess Premier got rid of him, whatever. They haven't replaced him. The Walmart manager for that store got sick of the 20 boxes sitting in the back. From what the Anderson lady told me, he put return labels on every single one of them, and they shipped it back. Got it the hell out of here. He said, if they're not going to stock it, I don't want it in my store. He sent all 20 MJ Holden boxes back. Now, that's not the only store in my area that hasn't stocked in a while. Premier is really dropping the ball here. From what I gather, they don't pay much. They pay like 12 bucks an hour. Anderson pays like 15. Um, Premier pays 12. And from what I gather too, the, the district guy for um, Premier in this area, um, I don't know. From what I hear, some, sometimes he doesn't really say the right things to some people, right? So whatever that's just what i hear that's what word on the street is and he can set some people off and what happens when you don't pay well and you try to verbally you know uh put the smack down on them they ain't gonna do it they ain't gonna do it i mean you pay me like 25 30 bucks an hour you know you can go ahead and say a few things i'll look i'll, I'll overlook it that's fine it's cool but if you pay me 12 bucks an hour you better be like hey you know what we appreciate you Thank you for doing the job. You're great. You're wonderful. You're going to pay me 12 bucks an hour and the gas price is the way it is. You're going to send me all over the place and not because they only pay like, I guess, like a quarter. If you go over 20, travel over 25 miles, they only give you a quarter per mile over 25 miles. So they don't like, if it's under 25 miles traveling, they don't pay you anything for gas. So just think about that. These people for Premier aren't getting paid nothing. Just leave it there. All right. All right, guys, so this is another thing. I got my two optic blasters right here, and I got one of these. I picked up one of these. Uh, a buddy of mine uh, sent me the text today. He says, hey, man, I've been killing on. I've been killing it on these. He says, if you find the Chronicles football in the white packs, he's like, you can see through them, basically. He's like, you look through the back. If you see a player's name or whatever, and he's like, pick it up. You know, it, it can be like a prism or whatever, something like that. And I looked at this one in the store. And I can't really see it right now, but I think it was a Kyle Pitts. And it's like the uh, score one, like the chrome score, I think it is in the back. See how it has those those silver runs right there? That's the score, right? I believe that's the score one, right? And it looks like it was the Kyle, right there, you can see right there, Kyle Pitts. So we'll see. We know we got a Kyle Pitts, the score ones. I like the score chrome ones. So that's the trick to that, folks, right here. So let's go ahead and open up that one right now and see what, see what we got. It is the Kyle Pitts. What's the score? Is it Prism? Come on, boys. Be, be a Prism. Uh, Lattimore. Field base. There you go. There you go. Michael Pittman. Derrick Henry. Keys. Eck. Najee. Najee Trois. Menage Trois. ETN. Bateman. There goes a Pitts, Panini, Felipe, a CD. That's the bronze, a CD bronze. Oh, here we go. What's this one? Dante Johnson, Pinnacle. Is that a fat pack exclusive, the Pinnacles? Yep, that's what it is. Oh, a TB. TB12 Pinnacle. Uh oh, I remember Pinnacle back in the day. And there we got our Kyle Pitts. There it is. The score. I like these score of one. So I went ahead and picked it up. Is there a prism? Nah, it's just a base. Womp, womp, womp. All right, but still. That's the card we thought was in there. And I like these score ones. These score ones are pretty tight. Where the hell is score 2022, right? Shouldn't that be out by now? Let's leave up my Brady, too. But anyway, let's get into this optic football. Enough story time. Enough Chronicles. Let's hit it. All right, guys. You know what I like to do real quick? Um, like I do anything real quick? Uh, let's look at... I like these purple shocks. That's why um, I'm getting the blasters. It doesn't matter to me if it was like pink shocks in there right now. You know what I mean? It's like optic. Uh, Zach Wilson, purple shock. $40 best offer was accepted. Let's see which ones they ended straight up. Trey Lance for 75. 
Kyle Trask for 10. There's a Zach Wilson for 40. A 142 for the Trey. Wow. 18 for the Micah. $87 for the Mac Jones, which leaves me the link. I did one of these boxes off camera, folks, just to kind of like get a little quick rip. All right. And I'll show you what I pulled out of that. 14 on the Micah again. Davis Mills, 17. Uh, $69.99 on the Mac. Best offer was accepted. So you get three purple shocks per blaster, 82 on the Mac, 2450 on the Zach, 98 on the Mac. I pulled up these in, in particular because uh, I wanted to see 125 on the Mac. What the one I pulled for off camera, right? Jamar Chase, Red Hot Rookie, and I pulled the Mac. And this was my test box, guys. My test box. I was like, oh, man, I should. Why didn't I have this one? Why didn't I have the uh, camera running? Oh. So I pulled the Mac, and it looks minty, too, bro. A ETN, silver, a Waddle, shock, and a Najee base. So the first blaster off camera was actually pretty good. I hope these follow suit. Let's get into it. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, I was really hoping to load up on these things. I was going to do a some type of a giveaway. I wasn't sure how I was going to do it yet. I was going to do it differently than I did it last time, but the same. You know what I mean? Something close to the same, but something different. Does that make sense? That doesn't make any sense. I don't make any sense. Who cares? Let's just crack the facts. It just doesn't matter anymore. Curtis. Uh-oh. Cornell, rated rookie, the first rook, and we got a Shy Smith in the purple shock. It doesn't look like there's like any chance of autos in retail. I don't think there's any number cards in a retail for this. I said I don't think. I don't think so. I really don't. Jared Patterson, rated rook. And who we got right here? Jamar Chase gifted. And we got a silver behind that of Corey Davis. Aw. Jamar Chase. Really OC on the back. Look at that. Oof. Front looks good. Front looks kind of on point though, right? Nice looking rook. Insert. Get three shocks. You're going to get a silver. You got one shock so far. We got a silver. Got the insert. 24 cards, I believe, in a box. 35 bucks through Wally. Tua. McCaffrey. These look really nice. I mean, the centering is off, of course, a little bit on some of them, but the surfaces have looked pretty good so far. Um, out of that test one, I did get one damage. A Kelvin Joseph. And you know what, guys? I showed you two of the purple shocks that I pulled, right, out of that other blaster. This was the third. So this is the second Kelvin Joseph out of that case. Oof. What the? So this stuff's lumping together. If I can get why, why can't I get two Mac Joneses? Why I gotta get two Kelvin Josephs? Had two Jamar Chase inserts, so something tells me I'm gonna I might get a Jamar Chase rookie coming up eventually. Najee, that's the second Najee Harris base, right? Deja vu. What's the last one here? We got Jay. Oh, are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me right now? Are you freaking kidding me? What? Guys, guys, guys. What did I show you, right? 
what I show you. Najee, Jalen Waddle. It was a Jamar Chase insert. ETN was my silver, though. And I got the Mac. Where's the uh, Calvin Joseph? I don't know. It's in there. I didn't prioritize it. But, man, I tell you what. Trust me, I got the Calvin Joseph as my other purple shock. I've got one more coming, right? No, oh, that's the other one. Uh, no, Shy Smith was the third. I was going to say, maybe I, maybe the third one will be the Mac. No, no, no. Crazy. Running it all. This thing's thick. Oh, I got a mem. Yeah. Nick Chubba. Levi Aworski. I got his rookie out of the other one, too. And here we go. Rookie Phenom. Kyler Murray got two silvers out of this. Rookie Phenom, Hyper Blue, Dwayne Eskridge. Nice looking card. Can barely even make them out because the uniform and everything matches, right? Eh, eh. Got the Kyler Silver. This guy going to come back strong or what? Well, yeah, he was having some issues or something like that. Towards the end of the year, wasn't he? One pack left. Derek Carr. This thing is bowed. I got another shock? No, I thought it was a shock. No, it looks like it's an insert. Uh, Chris Carson. And Ian Book bowed. And out of the other blaster, guess what I got, guys? I got an Ian Book bowed badly, just like this. And we got here, my house. Welcome to my house. Look at that. I got to dwell on the negative, right? That sucker is freaking... You eat some cereal out of that. Hot dog. Woo. Wow. I like that, though. I like these my houses. Can't tell. See that right there? I wonder if that's like can't be part of it. It might be, because look, it's at the bottom, too. There's like a stress in it. it. looks fine. It feels fine. It's part of the design, maybe? Right there, or is it just missing, like, ink? Prism. I wonder if they're all Prism. All the My Houses, are they all Silvers? If you do know the answer to that, please let me know down below, because that other, uh, gifted jamar chase was not but the insert that i got out of the other one that fire jamar chase right here they are and i don't see i looked on a checklist it doesn't say anything about like a base and a silver so not bad not bad not bad all right next one up crazy freaking crazy Freaking crazy, man. No more mems. No more mems. We got paper here. What we got? It's just a purple. It's not a shock. It's just a purple. Would that be numbered? Irv Smith. Kamora. Pete Werner, and what do we got right here? Oh, it is a shock. Okay, Chris Evans. Oh, bangle, buddy. It is a shock. I've seen that part right there, and I was like, oh, it doesn't look like a shock. But it was. So one shock down. Kevin Bard. Bard. Yeah, I hear. Rookies, Gridiron Kings, Elijah Moore. And our silver is of. Oh, I see the pasties helmet. Man, why you do that to me? Oh. Man. Love my silvers, though. 
I got two out of the last one. Maybe we can uh, get another one, right? Here's all. Here's the hoping. Singletary, Kurt, Frank Darby, and Brownie, Greg Newsom. One more shock to go. I got three packs left. I got one shock left. Maybe another silver. There's the shock right here. Brian Dawkins. OBJ. Quitty Pay. And Ian Book. No, Pete Werner. Pete Werner is the last shock. Wah, wah, wah. Oh, we got a silver. Drew. Tyler Lockett. And we got Matt Jones base, baby. Woohoo. Nice too. Looks real good. If you got any of this stuff, guys, you guys got the my house, and I'm really, I'm really concerned about that. <laughs> Cause I don't know if it's damage or by design. Nice. Look at that thing. Oof. Beautiful looking card. Sweet. One pack left. One pack. One pack remaining. Got an insert. It's got a lion. Yeah. Let me downtown. You can get downtowns out of these blasters, guys. So look out. That's another silver. Oh, that's an insert. That's why. Matty Ryan. Uh, Tucker. And who do we got right here? It's the lion. And it's Retro Series Barry Sanders. Retro Series. What the? Uh, see this this prism right here too. I wonder if they all are. They probably are. So if you're a berry guy, this one will be up on my eBay. Link will be down below. So two boxes, guys, right here. I did one before. You see what I showed you? What I pulled before. Do a quick, quick cap on this one. The inserts. Got the retro berry. The Mac Jones, Mr. My House. Mac Jones. That's a nice looking card. I like these My House. I like the ones in basketball too that came out, man. These My Houses. Last year I was liking them. I like that series. I like how this it's nice. Nice cards. These gifted rookies. I don't know quite how I feel about this. They seem kind of festive. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Get six purple shocks. Mr. Werner. Newsome. Chris Evans. Uh, Waddle, it's not a bad one. Kelvin Joseph and Shy Smith. Then we got four. The other blaster I did too, uh, same way. Devin White, Damian Harris, Kyler Murray, not bad one there. Kyler Murray Silver and Corey Davis. So the Silvers were a little lacking. Nice Kyler Murray there if he can bounce back. You know, it is what it is. Then out of that Chronicles pack, man. Pulled the Brady. Brady Pinnacle. Looks pretty nice, too. Got Kyle Pitts score. I was hoping that was going to be a prism. I don't know if those score ones are in prism. They, they, I would think they, it's a chrome. Then the Mac base. Then these are the ones I pulled out of the other blaster. We did get a Najee out of this, too, didn't we not? I believe so. Oh yeah, I forgot about oh yeah the other the other insert. Forgot about this guy. Just kind of threw him off to the side. The Jets guy. Nice card though. Nice action shot. They're almost like looks like animated, right? Like cartoony, like a Marvel comic type deal. And then of course the Eskridge rookie phenom patch. So it's pretty good. Two boxes. 
And if you include the other one in there before it, I mean, hot dog. Yeah, another Najee, two Najees. So, whew. Love an optic, as I knew I would. Always love optic every year. Optic, optic, optic. I want more optic, and but this is sad because I honestly don't think I'm going to find any more locally. I'm thinking about driving up to uh, deeper into Orlando. The other side of Orlando is like the only Barnes & Noble in my area that really carries the uh, sports cards. A lot of the other ones don't do it. Some of them are closed down right now remodeling-wise. Um, I'm thinking about it. I may do it next week just to try to find some more of this stuff because other than that, I mean, it's what's going on. You guys in your local area, your Walmarts, are they restocking? Look at the price tags, okay, on the shelving. Look for a little date at the bottom below the price, and you can see what's the last dates they restocked by the price by the price tags on there. And uh, let me know. Leave a comment down below. Like, share. Bye for now. Off to the next. Later.